Hey hockey fans, welcome back to the channel. Today let's take a look at the career of Big Buff. Dustin Bufflin, born March 27, 1985, is an American former professional ice hockey player. He is a native of Minneapolis, Minnesota, US. Hockey is not just a sport in Minneapolis, Minnesota, it's a vital part of the cultural fabric. As a youngster, Buffalo was immediately enamored with ice hockey, and with his stepfather Dale Smedsmo playing four games in the NHL for the Toronto Maple Leafs in the early 70s, and mostly in the WHA, his love for the game only grew. After moving to Warrenville, Illinois to play AAA under 18, Dustin would later move to Canada to play major junior hockey, first with the Brandon Wheat Kings and later with the Prince George Cougars. Dustin Bufflin was drafted 245th overall in the 2003 NHL Entry Draft by the Chicago Blackhawks. He would bounce back and forth between the AHL, Norfolk Admirals, Rockford Ice Hogs, and the Chicago Blackhawks before entering the NHL to stay on November 3, 2007. His first shift with the Blackhawks in the 2007-8 season, he scored his first goal against the St. Louis Blues. On November 30th, he scored his first career hat-trick against the Phoenix Coyotes. Dustin would play three seasons in the Windy City, winning the Stanley Cup with the Blackhawks in his final season, 2010. He was a force for the Hawks in the 2010 playoffs, registering 11 goals and 5 assists, including 3 goals in the final, to defeat the Philadelphia Flyers in 6 games. Helping the Blackhawks win their first Stanley Cup since 1961, and fourth title in franchise history. On June 24, 2010, Buffalo was traded to the Atlanta Thrashers in a multiplayer deal. In Atlanta, he would move back to playing defense and would also be named an alternate captain. Buffalo would play one season in Atlanta before the team relocated to Winnipeg to become the Jets. He was voted to four All-Star games, 2011, 2012, 2015, and 2016. He would not play in the 2012 All-Star game due to injury. During his first All-Star game in 2011, his slap shot was clocked at 102.5 miles per hour. Later that same year, the Thrashers signed him to a contract extension of $26 million over five years. While playing for the Winnipeg Jets, Bufflin recorded a career-high 20 goals and 56 points for the 2013-14 season. On February 8, 2016, Bufflin signed a five-year $38 million contract extension that would keep him in Winnipeg until the end of the 2020-21 season. Less than three weeks before the start of the 2019-20 season, he was granted a personal leave of absence from the Jets. Shortly after this, Buffalo would be suspended by the Jets for failing to report to camp. This was later reported to be an excuse by the Jets to make salary cap relief. He underwent surgery for a high ankle sprain in late October 2019 without the team's direct involvement. On February 24, 2020, the Jets announced that Buffalo would not return for the remainder of the season. On April 17, shortly into the COVID-19 pandemic, the Jets and Buffalo mutually agreed to a contract termination. Standing 6 foot 5 inches and weighing 260 pounds, Bufflin is more than imposing on the ice. He is in select company among the most physically intimidating players ever to play the game. His strength and size have been a significant advantage throughout his career, allowing him to dominate in defense and play effectively in multiple positions. His athletic prowess contributed to the Chicago Blackhawks Stanley Cup victory in 2010 marking him as the first black American-born player to win the Stanley Cup. Dustin Bufflin and Vander Kane are two professional ice hockey players who have been teammates in the past. They were both part of the Atlanta Thrashers organization, which later became the Winnipeg Jets. In 2015, an incident occurred where Bufflin reportedly threw Kane's tracksuit into the shower, an act that was seen as a message about team discipline and respect for the dress code. This event was one of several that led to Kane being traded from the Jets to the Buffalo Sabres. After retiring from professional hockey, Bufflin turned his attention to professional fishing, where he continues to apply his strength and skill. He played for the Chicago Blackhawks, Atlanta Thrashers, and Winnipeg Jets. Drafted as a defenseman, he played both forward and defense in his career, though he generally played defense in his later seasons. His personality, while not as openly displayed to the press, was considered as large as his frame contributing to his reputation as a well-respected player among his peers. Hey hockey fans, if you like this content, please punch that subscribe button. You can also follow my blog at https tedtalkshockey.com and remember to keep your stick in the ice. Thanks for watching.